Hello there, Claire back again with another project that I've been working on. This is a Christmas card in a box made from the Christmas Emporium Graphic 45 papers. I used the 8x8 papers and one of the Graphic 45 boxes and um, decorated the box. I painted it in white gesso first um, just to seal it and then painted it with the red pepper dabber, edged everywhere in gold, I don't know if you can see that, and then I've only used two papers, or three papers, um, throughout, so I covered each of the sides of the box and the front and back with the papers, and the back, I've left that blank and then put most of the detail on the front of the box. So to start with I cut out the children peeping through the window from the signature sheet of um, the paper and put some glossy accents over the toys so that it gives it a bit of a, a shimmer and also on the stocking that was hanging up and stuck that down on the underside and then built up with the Father Christmas. I cut him out and then cut him out, I stuck him onto some chipboard and cut him out just to give him a bit of strength. And then I cut out some of the holly leaves from the paper and covered them in glossy accents. And the same up here as well, I cut the bow out and the holly leaves and covered the holly leaves in glossy accents. And then used some candy cane stickles for the berries and then cut a couple of the toys out and just stuck them at the bottom there and then the Christmas cheer words from the paper as well and then I've put some icicle stickles at the bottom just to give it a bit of a wintry feel and then inside I'll put a little tab on here just to um, open the box Inside it's just dotty spotty and then I use the children um, on the two spines and then fussy cut out some of the children and the holly leaves and just pop them on there and again put some stickles on the corners just to give a wintry sparkle and the same on here, some more children playing with their toys and then this side I've done the same, so I don't, I don't think I can, I can't show it you all. And then the card in the middle, the box came with an album that had four pages, but I wanted to make a card, um, so I cut one of the pages off and then folded the next page so that it just had um, about an inch and a half flap up and down just to give a bit of dimension to the card. Uh, let me take it out. So there's the inside of the box, all covered. Oh dear, <laughs> I've got a bit off camera, sorry. So again, I really enjoyed doing that. Let's pop them over there. And the card itself stands up. I like that. Let me show you what I did. I cut the fireplace out of the paper and then I cut the Christmas tree out and laid the Christmas tree over the, the fireplace. I covered the actual card in red paper first and then I cut from the second sheet Father Christmas and the children out and just raised him up on pop dots to give some dimension. A bit like decoupage I suppose really. And then I've put some glossy accents on the chair backs, if you can see, and on the stocking and the candle up here and the letter poking out of the stocking there. And then I cut one of the words out, or the sayings out of the paper, and pop that onto the front here. And again, cover that in glossy accents. And then that's joined underneath, I don't know if you can see. Um, so that it doesn't open up any further 
and it stands up. And then inside, I've just left some room for notes. I found this fantastic um, mask. It's that special touch of, is the make of it. And it's a holly wreath. I don't know if you can see that, it might be a bit too shiny. Really delicate, really lovely. So I've used it around the edge of the card here just to give a bit of detail but without putting anything on the card and then I've covered the back as well and then he fits back in the box It's a great little project, I had great fun making it and I hope I inspire you to have a go at one too.